The financial industry today is dominated by large corporations that have not seen disruption for over a century. Navas' last new project aiming to change the current order of things are involving. We have interviewed the representative of WeTrust, fast developing project that attempts to turn the industry upside down. Hello, Patrick. First of all, what is WeTrust? Thanks for your question, Anna. Let me tell you a little bit about WeTrust. WeTrust is an Ethereum decentralized application used to leverage social capital, trust networks, and blockchain technology to create a financial system that has aligned interests with all its participants. This is in sharp contrast with the current banking system, where one cannot get an affordable loan without a well-paying job or good credit. We want to change the way people save and lend today and allow those that don't have access to traditional financial means a way to bootstrap themselves and grow their uh, capital. For whom is this platform? We trust Roska is going to be powered by smart contracts and blockchain technology. This will be a savings and credit platform that will allow users to lend and borrow from each other at self-determined interest rates with minimal friction. The immediate purposes that WeTrust Rosca will serve will create an affordable path for 2 billion unbanked to obtain and track savings and credit, it will be a competitive alternative asset class for savers, and it will facilitate group savings as a more effective way to reach individual savings goals. Okay, so our, for our product will address you know multiple audiences the main audiences are those who are unbanked right and they don't have access to credit and the other audience are the people that already do have formal financial institutions however they're looking for an alternative right they're looking for alternative solutions to savings and credit and how could you they join the project it's really nice that you're interested in wanting to join our project if you would like to play with our MVP, which tentatively will be finished and deployed on the Ethereum mainnet by February 6th, please visit Roska, R-O-S-C-A dot we trust, W-E-T-R-U-S-T dot I-O. If you want to participate in our upcoming crowd sale and support the movement, please stay tuned. We'll be announcing the details of our fundraiser shortly. And how will the P2P lending platform work? Will you be asking borrowers to put assets up as a collateral for their loans? Four persons can potentially use, and it's e-signing and legal binds uh, through a legal contract that requires faithful adherence and payment to the Roska. So if you default on your payments, the group could potentially use this you know, e-sign document to come after you. So this is more of a deterrent for higher value Roscas, where legal action would potentially be worthwhile. And finally, another idea that we've been playing with is potentially having members contribute an amount of collateral, right? You can put up some collateral in a smart contract, which will essentially, you know, give the property to the group if you miss your payment or you breach the agreement. And this could be something like, you know, the title to your house or the title to your car. Assets that are less liquid, right, but would allow you to gain access to a Roska with higher dollar amounts. So these three ideas, reputation risk, legal risk, and collateral risk, we think is sufficient to have it so that, you know, people don't cheat the system and there's more trust in the community. Of course, we're always exploring more ways, and in the future, as we come up with better and better solutions, we will integrate those into our platform. Thanks a lot, Patrick.